What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're in the downtown Las Vegas Arts District. Got a really cool video for you today. We're gonna to see a lot of artwork. We're gonna visit with renowned Las Vegas artist, uh, Pete Castro, take a look at his new mural, ask him a few questions about it, and mostly just walk around and get a sense of what it's like down here in Las Vegas and in downtown in the Arts District and what it would be like for somebody who was thinking about living in this area. So thanks for tuning in. Please like and subscribe. Please comment below if you'd like me to profile any other Las Vegas neighborhood. I'd be happy to bring you that content. Thanks. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. I'm really excited today to be down here in the Arts District in Las Vegas with Pete Castro, well-known artist here in Las Vegas who just is completing an amazing new mural that's down here. We're in the shadow of the stratosphere right in downtown Las Vegas. So Pete, thank you for taking a little time to talk with us today about your mural, man. Dude, you're crushing it, so it's an honor. Awesome, <laughs> thanks, man. Well, listen, I have a bunch of questions for you about your mural, so sure. tell me, uh, well, what's the story of the mural to start with? I mean, how'd this come about? Well, the owners of the property uh, basically wanted to do a, a thing, but they okay. said, Pete, you're, you're artistic talent, just do your stuff. So they gave you license to kind of- Anything I want. Oh, sweet. So I, went, I grew up in New York City. Okay. So my, my vibe is 90s hip hop, kind of vibe, yeah. graffiti. So this is what I came up with, which is this crazy Las Vegas monorail, um, insane graffiti characters. And my influence is Justin Bula, who you know, Justin Okay. Bula. So he has mentored me and showed me his skills and that's basically his style too. Okay. Yeah. Now anybody who's been in Allegiant Stadium in the owner's suite floor, the 150 level suites, <laughs> has seen Pete's work because there's a huge painting right there and a couple others throughout the stadium. Uh, same kind of style. So yeah, this is an awesome style, man. It's just city, music. You got these characters. Are these characters that reappear in your theme here? Or, uh, I usually or use this guy a lot. This guy you've used a lot? <laughs> yeah, okay. Used a lot. What's up with the guy with the TV head? <laughs> well, originally it was a certain person. Okay. And he was very modest. He's like, please take me off. Really? Yeah, so I, okay. I, I, I turned it into a surrealistic piece and it was great for the energy and it kind of matched. Yeah. It actually worked out. So. Awesome. Well, yeah. I love this art, man. And um, there's so many cool, cool murals down here. It's awesome to see one of yours go up. <laughs> and do you have any others in Las Vegas? Any uh, big ones? There's some possible comes stuff. coming up. Possible, okay, yeah. some possible. stuff coming up. We'll have to yeah, check yeah. those out then. <laughs> well, listen, thanks for telling us about your mural, yeah. and uh, thank you for adding it to the Las Vegas downtown scene so awesome. we can all enjoy it. <laughs> this is on the corner of Charleston and Third Avenue, and it's going to be on the north side of Charleston, and you can check it out for yourself. Come by and see Pete's mural. Support his art. Where can people find your artwork, Pete? Uh, Raiders Stadium. Of course in the Raiders Stadium, but I'm saying where can website. they find you on the website? Uh, www.castroart.vegas. Castroart.vegas, and then social media, of course, Instagram, yes. Facebook, all that stuff. Pete Castro, Castro yeah. Art, Castroart.vegas. Check them out. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll go stroll around and check out the rest of the arts district down here. So thanks for watching the video. Please like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. Dude. Thanks, man. <laughs> You're the man, bro. <laughs> I appreciate you talking to me about this. Bro. Big is strong, October 1, 2017. Of course, we had the big massacre here, so that's a nice mural. Loving memory of the victims. Greetings from Las Vegas mural. This one's so cool, it deserves a second of looking at it. You got the stratosphere in the L. Beautiful sunset in the Las. You got the dice and the cards in the V. I'm not sure who that guy is, some gangster with an atomic bomb going off in the background in the E. You've got, it uh, looks like the Hoover Dam maybe in the G, or no, Hoover Dam's in the A, maybe the Red Rock Canyon National Conservation Area there in the G, and you got the old Casino Cowboy in the S. Such a cool mural. Just so much artwork. It's supposed to be a video about the neighborhood, and I'll show some neighborhood stuff, but the coolest thing about this neighborhood is all the artwork. So I'm gonna show you a lot of that. It's a great place to come and take pictures. I mean, you got these guys right here taking pictures, but my wife and I will come down here and take pictures. I mean, there's just so many cool backdrops. artwork starting to come alive down here
Only follow this white rabbit if you want to escape the matrix. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Yard art. You could get a big bull. Or a bear. Maybe bullish or bearish. You get a cowboy on a bull. Buffalo. Snake. Hey, Bigfoot does exist. You got a samurai on a horse. You got some more T-Rexes. This place is so cool. If you had a big property here in Vegas, you wanted some lawn art, this is your place, man. This thing is just absolutely massive. Look at this whole stagecoach with horses. You could get a little dinosaur. Or a big dinosaur. Look at this, a dinosaur popping out the egg. Get a goat. Look at this guy, wow. What is this one called again? This is the, uh, can't remember. That's so dumb. That's like one of the most commonly known dinosaurs, I think, is this big one here. I cannot remember the name. Look at this, you can get a UFO for your yard. Shout out to artistic, artisticiron.com. That's what it is, my bad, artisticiron.com. This even got a uh, littler version of the stagecoach stage here. This is alligator. Another massive T-Rex. Oh, and you even have a T-Rex with a smaller dinosaur in its mouth. You have a T-Rex with a giant head. This is the arts factory, so there's a lot of spaces down here where artists can come and rent out a space to have their own gallery. Over 30 art galleries in this in this building. Let's see if it's open right now. It's not. But if you're an artist, and you're thinking of moving to Las Vegas, or if you're in Las Vegas and you're looking for a space to show your artwork, you might wanna check out the corner of Charleston and Art Way. art factory really cool spot they have events down here they drive traffic to the artist stores And then across the street, you've got the art square, which I'm not sure what this is, but just to kind of do some digging over here and find out about this place, the art square. Now there's a hair studio and it looks like maybe just a vacant uh, commercial, a couple of vacant commercial locations there.
This building is the Newport Lofts, and you can rent a unit in there, a studio unit for about $2,100, $2,200 right now, or you could rent a one bedroom for about $3,000. I'll have to do a video one of these days on the building itself. Whereas something like this might rent for $1,100, $1,200 bucks for a one bedroom right across the street from the lofts. We got the 24 hour wedding chapel down here in case get married on the fly. Got places like this for rent around here and big buildings to rent condos in. There's also some older single family homes and a lot of little apartments, inexpensive apartments. It's a theater down here. They host weddings, corporate events, team building events, and parties here. Thank you so much for tuning in to another video uh, profile, profiling a cool Las Vegas neighborhood. I'm your host, Cassidy Lane. And please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, if you wanna see more content like this, or make suggestions down below in the comment section of what you might like to see about Las Vegas. I'm happy to show that to you. And uh, keep coming back, share, like, subscribe. Thank you so much, I appreciate your support. And of course, if you need anything uh, real estate wise in Las Vegas, I'm your guy, hit me up. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video, thanks.